Hey kids and welcome to another Minecraft Total Toys review. Today we are reviewing the Cave Biome Collection. Now this is three and four of the four different collections that we get. The third one that we have, which is over here, we have Doom Drawbridge, and the fourth one here is Waterfall Wonder. So let's open up Doom Drawbridge first. On the front of the box, you can see Doom Drawbridge and what the set looks like. So we can see at the top, is included with this creeper and down here we can see Minecraft drawbridge. On this side of the box we are able to see what it includes. It includes one mini environment, one creeper minifigure, and one connector piece so we can connect the different biomes together. On the back of the box you are able to see the four other biomes that are in this bo cave biome collection. On this side of the box we can see our play feature, it says activate the drawbridge to defend against the creeper. So let's open this up and see what's inside. Here's what the mini environment looks like outside the box, but not outside the plastic. We can see a sneak peek of what the environment will look like. So here we can see the creeper with its mini environment, and over here, we have a connector piece that connects the different biomes together. So here's the creeper. It's basic as almost any creeper that you would see in the game. It's got a block head, four legs. Here's the side, the back, the other side, and the front again with the standard creeper's face that everybody knows and, well, doesn't love so much. This is the connector piece that we get that connects the different biomes together, and we will show you how to use that later on in the video. So back to the main thing that we're looking at is this mini environment. So the front, you can see we get some stairs and sand and some basic stone because it is a cave collection biome thing. We have some stone on this side, stone here, so here, except we got a little pressure plate, we'll show you what that does later, and the stairs, and the redstone. So the things I mostly pick up for this playset and playing features is this oddly colored stone right here, the redstone, and this pressure plate. Now what this main thing is trying to say is creepers are not loud in our base. So let's say a creeper is trying to cross the bridge. Now once it gets to this little piece right here, all you do is you don't push this pressure plate like our other previous sets have done. You don't push anything, you actually twist this block. So if we just hold this still, we can twist this block, which makes the creeper fall into the lava and, you know, die. Like anything would do in lava. So let's check out the other cave biome collection. So here's our waterfall wonder outside the box, but not quite outside of its plastic. So we can see a little bit of a sneak peek here, but let's get it fully out. Once again, we get a collector piece, a basic two by two square, which we will show you how to use later on in the video when we connect these two biomes together. So let's look at this biome first. We can see a wonderful waterfall, hence the name, Right here, it's streaming down this mining environment. We see some stone, we also see a hinge, a block empty here, and more stone. We do get a little bit look of some grass blocks, a coal block, and a gold block there. But let's show the playing feature before we show Alex completely. So the play feature, well, the main play feature. You know in the game, you always have water constantly falling down a mountain as of this one. Well, the cool thing about this is you can, in, in a way, pick up the water as you would do in the game if you really wanted it to go away. So what you do is you simply fold this piece up, which gives you a block, that's why there were hinges here, and you close this block down. So now, just gives you a normal blocky environment with absolutely no waterfall. So let's take a closer look at Alex. So here we can see Alex, she has her basic orange hair that is going right down her shirt as you can see there. She has a golden pickaxe, 
Here's the back of her, the side, and right back to the front. You know, any basic standard Alex. I like how these minifigures are really close to what the Alex in the game would look like in any other figure that goes for. So here we can see Alex. Let's just show you that play feature one more time. Letting the water go down the waterfall just by, whoops, clicking this down, clicking this up. Which also puts this cold block upside down but gives you a nice pretty waterfall look. So let's show you how you can connect the two biome pieces together. So here we can see our two biomes side by side, but let's get them connected together. So let's take Alex and the creeper off for the moment as being. Now, something I didn't show you until now is the bottom of these play pieces has a four by four square, which is easy to collect, put these two, this connector piece onto. So all we do is we simply go over here and we clip this piece on. Then we just connect it to the other piece, as so. So by using this, you can connect a 2 by 2 square, or if you wanted to connect it a little bit different, you just simply take it off the way you put it back on, and you connect it by corners, or basically any way you want. So let's connect like this. I know it's going to look a little weird in this view, but it'll look normal -er when we put it down. So you simply just clip these pieces into the squares. And this is a different way you can clip them to make your environment a little bit different. So let's put these minifigures back on where they belong. And we have an extra connector piece which I will just put there. So that is the end of this Minecraft Total Toys review and I hope you enjoyed.